Oh, Kyun Master. How's Cheta? Will he be all right? Yep. He needed to sleep and recover tonight. I think he'll be fine tomorrow. Yeah! I'm glad to hear that. Yep, yep, that's a load off my mind, by golly. Hey, hey, that's great. Chata will be okay. Hey, hey. Kyun Master. What is this on floor? Kyun Master, you said Chata saved you at that cave long ago. Can you tell us about it? Yep, this is what happened. Kyun Master, watch out! Cabotops and his brutes attacked us without warning. Chatao reacted first and shielded me from them, and he got knocked out. I sent Cabotops gang packing after that, but Chatao was knocked out. I didn't know what to do. I was in a panic because I couldn't help Chatao. That's when Lapras appeared. Lapras? Yep, Lapras. Lapras saved Chatao. Oh, I see. That's how you met Wigglytuff, Lapras. Yes. I didn't intend to reveal myself at all. I changed my mind the instant I saw Chata on the ground. I simply had to help. Afterward, I made Wigglytuff promise me something. A promise? Yes. Hey, hey! So what was that promise? I think Lapras recognized that we were on the exploration team right away. So he said to us... That he couldn't tell if we were bandits with big ambitions, or if we were an exploration team with good intentions. So he asked for the sake of the world's peace that we please not investigate the peculiar pattern there. That's what he asked for us. So, what was your reply, Guildmaster? Wigglytuff promised to honor my request most agreeably. He said he owed me thanks for coming to Chatot's aid, and he would stop all investigations into the matter. So that's what happened, but... Why didn't you want anyone to investigate the pattern? In a hidden land, the Sempora Tower where Dialga reigns. Dialga feared intruders could wreak havoc at the tower that regulates time. Dialga decided to protect Temporal Tower. He hid a hidden land in a gap in time. A gap in time? Yes. It's hard to explain, but it's a gap in time itself. It's a space between parts of a split second. I see. No wonder that place couldn't be found. A gap in time. No one could ever hope to go to such a place. No. Helga left one key friend in the hidden land. That's a special fragment with a mysterious pattern etched into it. When I heard wise old Torkoal's tale, when I saw Munchlax's relic fragment, I finally understood. I realized that the peculiar pattern was linked to the hidden land. That's why I headed out to Brian K before everyone else went. Because I had to see Lapras. met with Lapras and explained what was happening. A time was stopping all over how the world was in peril. I also explained how the time gears needed to be taken to the Temporal Tower. So I asked him to reveal how we can get to the Hidden Land. So, what happened? Lapras revealed it to me. He said that the Relic Fragment chooses who will go to the Hidden Land. The Relic Fragment itself does that? It chooses on its own? Yep, apparently so. The Relic Fragment chose Munchlax. Hey, why did the Relic Fragment choose Munchlax? Don't really know. I think Dialga wants to prevent those with bad intentions in the hearts from entering Temporal Tower. That's why the important thing is the purity of heart. So Munchlax's heart must have resonated with the Relic Fragment. Anyway, we can do no more to help. From now on, this burden belongs to Munchlax and Azure. It's Team Seeker's weight to bear now. It's entirely up to them to get to the Hidden Land. It falls to them to stop the destruction of time. Uh, thank you for the exposition and then the save, but yes. Welcome back to Azure Plays Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers the Sky, where we're gonna have more story in sec two seconds. Hey, Lapras. Yes? You've been swimming a long time. Are you doing okay? I'm fine, Munchlax. No need for concern. Besides, we're almost there. See? It's coming into view. Huh? On the far horizon, do you see where the sea looks a little different? It's true. The waves. The waves are all twisted up. L Lapras! W what is that? The edge of the gap in time. That is the portal through which we will go to the hidden land.
Okay, here we go. Whoa, Lapras! Lapras is flying! No, that's not it. This... This isn't flying. Crossing the Sea of Time. Lapras! Is that it? Is that the Hidden Land? Yes, that is the Hidden Land. We're going in. This... this is the Hidden Land? We finally made it here. Please, look ahead. H hey what's that? Is that... is that perhaps... Yes, it's Temporal Tower. That's where Dialga is. That's where we have to go. Time Gears have to be taken there. But... take a closer look. That place seems to be floating in the sky. How are we supposed to get there? must take the Rainbow Stone Ship. The Rainbow Stone Ship? Yes. Far ahead, you'll find the old ruins. There you'll find an ancient mystical vessel. The Rainbow Stone Ship. We'll take you to Temporal Tower. Thank you, Lapras! This is the extent of what I could do for you. From here, you're on your own. Good luck on reaching Temporal Tower. Okay! Grovile, Azure! You don't have far to go now, let's keep it up! All right, we definitely don't. So, let's uh, see what we got going on storage-wise here. Uh, I got a bunch of grimy food and some pebbles and sticks. A couple apples. Uh, let's see, I, I need some orange berries because I used a lot earlier. So I'll take three. I think that should be fine. You have to go to Temporal Tower and set the time gears there. That'll put a stop to the destruction of time. You don't have far to go, Azure. First, we need to reach this Rainbow Stone ship. So yes, let's head on in and find the Rainbow Stone Ship. Hey Azure, are you all ready? Yep, looks like we're all set. All right, let's roll out. All right, let's head on in to the Hidden Land. And immediately find the first set of stairs. This place is actually really prettily designed, I'm gonna say so myself. Hello, um, I am going to, what do I got on me? Do I have a rock? <laughs> Uh, I do have some rocks. Perfect. Uh, can I equip this on you now? I cannot. Okay. So I'm gonna throw this. And hit you. I'm gonna throw it again. And, uh, Munchlax is gonna do that and miss. Throw one more just for good measure. And try again. This time you're gonna do stockpile anyway, so. There we go. And I'm gonna. Okay, that did nothing. There we go. 432 experience. That's actually not that bad. So I'm actually gonna swap over the tackle. See if we can get everyone close enough for this. And I'm gonna move down one. There we go, I'm gonna get an attack in myself. Perfect. The experience points are really, really good here, so if you wanna do some training, go right ahead. But if you wanna do some training, I would probably suggest taking out as much items as possible so you don't lose any. Ow, okay, that's gonna be an issue. Please don't do that again. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I'm gonna move out of the way. Help me a little bit, please. Thank you. Okay, come on. There we go. Speaking of level ups, one, 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 and one. Okay. Help me out a little bit, please. Thank you. I need to heal a little bit more. Okay, good to go. Perfect. Hello. <laughs> Ow. No stairs, but we got a sleeping Pokemon right there. I'm gonna leave him alone. We don't need a, the agitating Pokemon we don't need to be. Rebound Orb, that's actually useful, slightly. Can I hit him through this wall? That I can. Can he hit me though? He cannot, so let's throw a ton of rocks. I, okay, he has ancient power too. 
So I'm going to hit him. And he's going to do ancient power back. And I'm going to use basically ancient power battle. Perfect. Okay, I missed. Uh, let me throw another rock. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? We got body slam. Uh, inflicts damage on target. It may also inflict a perilous status condition. Pokemon with perilous status. Yeah, I know that. Uh, nice damage and good hit ratio. Um, stockpile is nice and headbutt's good. Let me let me check here. Uh, six and six. Six and five. So it's slightly weaker. How about tackle? Okay, its power is low, but its hit ratio is pretty dang high. I don't see him using tackle as much. I'm gonna get rid of tackle for body slam. Less PP, but he might use it. Yeah, level it up. And he kind of uses tackle as like his last resort. So if he uses body slam a little bit and do more damage, I'm perfectly fine with that. Use tackle is usually my uh, I don't want to waste PP move anyway. So I'm going to get out of the way. Okay, I'm going to do this. Because he's doing a lot of stuff that's kind of annoying. So let me get ancient power out. Perfect. Uh, let's try to be careful. Grove, I'll keep up with me. Okay. Uh, ancient power, please. Uh, okay, why didn't you now? Okay. Okay. I don't have any more reviver seeds after that, so, okay. <laughs> uh, let's just swap over to that and get some attacks in. Ow, I did a lot. Okay, good. That's actually going to be helpful for me because I can move... No, I'm just going to do this first. I'm going to miss. So I'm just going to move forward and then I'm going to do a couple attacks. What's this? Calm mind. I'm not going to need that. Uh, dead end, but I got my health back for the most part. And I just immediately lost it. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> at least I had... Uh, okay, that's not good at all. I'm next to the stairs, though, so I'm fine with that. So I'm just going to get out of here. Because I'm screwed by myself. And I don't want that to happen. Okay, let's just do this. I'm kind of happy you are able to reach. Oh. Ah, nah, stop it. Okay. Please. Oof. Okay. Okay, I don't really necessarily need that, but I'm gonna just eat it for just a little bit of a belly. And then attack. And then Grove Owl will do an attack too. Okay, perfect. So far, so good. I'm just kind of getting screwed over by super effectiveness here. Again, uh, sort of not as bad as Brian Cave because I can just have my other party members. I have multiple people, so it's all good. Uh, okay. I'm fine with that. Okay. Stairs, perfect. There's not many items here. I was hoping to find some like reviver seeds or something. Water type moves are weakened, thank you. <laughs> I need to watch out though because if Groval gets hit, uh, he's screwed. So that okay, hello. Uh, tackle. I actually have quite a few left. Uh, that means this is not gonna do. Okay, it does about the same amount of damage anyway. So, uh, help me a little bit. Why? Why did you move for me? Oh, please. Please, just help me. Okay. Okay, that was a little bit rough. Ah, uh, that's a complete dead end. So the stairs are all the way back this way. Chances of me finding an encounter on the way back? Actually kind of slim, surprisingly enough. Okay, I need some help. Alright, let's see if we can get some more help here. Okay, thank you. Throw a rock! I missed. 
<laughs> oh, thank you. That's actually really useful. Especially this late in the game. That's actually really useful. Uh, let's head over here. This is pretty straightforward, surprisingly enough. Uh, what is this? Itemizer orb. What does that one do? Turns the Pokemon into an item. What? Okay. Oh, come on. Okay, problem. Oh, would you please just hit him? Like that. Or you can do flatter. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go because they're not being smart. They're not attacking them and getting rid of them. Ooh. You grab that, I cannot. So I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna eat it. Okay, uh, problem. Hopefully you can't hit me for, come on. Okay. You grab both of these, hello. Grova, why are you over there? Maximizes, ooh, I am going to actually take that. Um, sure, just use that, I guess. Bam, <laughs> does two damage, but it's still two damage. Where my accuracy falling slightly? I hit it a bunch of times there. Oh, come on. Okay, sleep seed and a gummy. I would use that on Grovile, but uh, yeah. <laughs> Why would I? <laughs> okay, not good. Hit, please. Hit again. And tackle. I missed. Ow. Let me uh, get somebody else in there. I need help. I have sand attack status and it's quite a few times, so it's not good helping me. That's a lot of experience. 10 more of those and I'll level up again. Hello there. Thank you for the stockpile. I think we probably can use some more damage. Ow. I don't even know why I even bothered. I knew that was a dead end, and I looked at it, I saw it was a dead end, and I went down that way anyway. <sighs> why would you step on it, too? Ugh. Fine. No, roll out, roll out. Let's try roll out. I am getting rid of roll out. <laughs> I am still getting rid of roll out. It's nice to have, like, a two attack, but I rarely ever hit with it. It's so bad. Okay, and get a couple more attacks in there, and done. <sighs> okay, I can't pick that up. Why can't I pick it up? Uh, sure. Pick that up, because why not? Ah, no. Ah. Stupid cringing. Okay, let's uh, try to get my health back here. Please, okay, that's not good at all. Let me try to help out a little bit. Ah! <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna pick that up because I don't really have the space for it and it'd be a waste of time. Ah! Come on. <laughs> they mean to walk right into that. All I got left is slam. Great. At least I got double attack. Spurn orb. What does that even do? Randomly warps enemies. That's not what I... I can only think of one point where I would use that is if I get a monster house for any particular reason. 
Means this area is definitely not really suited. What? What does that do? Oh, okay. That's a uh, very ow. Very. Oh, come on. <laughs> Very, um, specific, to say the least. I surprised I- I'm really surprised I got all the way there if I getting hit once by poison. Let's try down, because I feel like up is a dead end. Watch- okay. I was gonna say, watch that be where the stairs are, but nope, I'm fine. Ow! No! No! Okay, that's not good. Need to right now. Okay! Uh, not cool. Let me swap back over. Okay, that was nice, getting extra health out of nowhere. Or not health, experience. I'm at that point where I'm losing too much HP, and uh, this is a problem. Uh, let me do this. Help me. Yeah, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I got rocks, I got rocks. <laughs> Throw the rock. Good, use dig. And I don't have anything anymore, so just wait. I, I know he can't talk right now. I'm trying to, uh... That, that works. Ah, and I didn't find the stairs. Uh, what about up here? Ah... Uh. Okay, swapping. Or not. <laughs> um. Uh, please do a lot. Okay, let's get them closer to me. Please get my health back. Please get my health back. Come on. Okay. Ah. I really don't need that right now. Let's try over here then. Okay, good. Stairs. Uh, item. Special band. Okay. Hello. Uh, Iron Thorn. <laughs> ah, gosh. Okay, swapping. Don't use stockpile right now. Ugh. What do I got? I got an Iron Band, Heal Seed, Violence Seed, XI. I got a blast seed. I got a petrify orb. Using it. Okay. I'm fine with that not working. <laughs> I'm very fine with that not working. Let's try over here. No stairs. Try to find those stairs really quickly. I have one orange berry and I have nothing I can really use. Is he like the only Pokemon in the room? Okay, everyone's at full health. Let's go on. Let's do this. Now that's how it's done. <laughs> when everybody helps me out, then it's good. But for some reason, Grovile isn't actually attacking half the time, and I don't know why. I think he might just be out of PP, and I can't tell because I can't check his moves or anything. <sighs> okay. Um, let me do this. <laughs> okay, that was neat. I'm not sure what that was, but it was kind of neat. More rocks. Perfect. Let me swap over to that. Much better than the thorns. I mean, they don't they don't do as much, but I can aim them. Right now, that's actually really useful for me. Next floor. What are we dealing with? Okay. Speaking of aiming. Now I don't even have to worry about that at all. Let's try it down this way. Oh, finally. 
Finally, I found a healing item here. On the last floor, I found a healing item. Really? Okay. According to Lapras, the old ruins lies beyond this dungeon. That's where we should find the Rainbow Stone Chip. If we find the Rainbow Stone Chip, we'll take that to Temporal Tower. Which, yes, so next time on Azure Plays, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon explores the sky. We head through the rest of this dungeon. Thankfully, I'm at the midpoint now, so I don't have to worry too much. But I think we should be fine. I can't check my items, sadly, so I am stuck with what I have. So I'm just going to make one more quick save, and uh, we'll head on through on the next episode. See you guys then.